dogs and tree, and how much people walk up to it. They said 30 people. 30 people go to that open house market. And I, when I, when it's my time to go, I just claim it, I said, that's mine. Mm -hmm. They, they really, just said, like, how you mean? I said, it's mine. Out of 30, I'm the one. And I was the one. When he called me, he said, how did you know that? I said, because I claim it. Mm -hmm. You have to claim it. You have to tell yourself, say, Come 2024, I'm not going to be this. I am going to be that. Mm -hmm. You know? You have to claim what you want. Claim it. And once you claim it, the, the universe listens. And then they give you the desire of your heart. You understand? Mm -hmm. Because it's not just look at your mouth. It's coming from your heart. And that's what God do, he look at your heart. Mm. Oh, he wants it, he's really hungry. You know, it's just like he see Isaiah in the wilderness, hiding from that one Jezebel woman. And when he look, he see that he's hungry. Isaiah didn't cry out, I'm hungry, I'm hungry. He look at his heart and he sent food. With a, with a drunkard, carry food, go give him. Because he see my heart say, oh, well, you have to need it. When you see he send food with a scavenger, that means the scavenger is the one that come and clean up the earth. Mm -hmm. So you can't turn your nose at nobody, even the, the, the man will call himself homeless. Not everybody homeless because they want to be homeless. Mm -hmm. They choose to be homeless. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So don't be, don't, if you see them, don't turn up your nose, say something to them. You understand? Because then they go back to Tyler Perry. And they go back to Steve Harvey. You see people with their thing pop up in their car and sleeping. It's not because they choose to do that. It's because things going and they're trying to find the right direction. Because society feels them. Mm -hmm. A lot of them you're going to their their, 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 their thing. They have their stock of money there. But the society feel them. And they don't know, they said, you know, if I pretend like I'm, I'm drunk, just I'm going back to the Bible again with David, when Saul want to kill him, David have been act like him a madman. We are tear of a king, you know. Have to go down to the level of the people in order to catch him. He had to act like a madman. So that Saul and the people them don't catch and devour him first. And guess what? He's the one who finds Saul in the cave sleeping. And he stand over him with his sword and his friend and will come with him and say, So just kill him now. He said, No. Me assure him, say, Look, me come down to your level and come find you. Sometimes you have to get down to the homeless level. Don't be afraid to go and talk to them and find out why they're homeless. Mm -hmm. Not everybody out there homeless is poor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There are some rich homeless people out here, mm -hmm. but society feels them. You know, I could be one of them because I lose three houses. Because what? Society feels me. Right. The market crash. Just as I buy those houses, start to put on tidying and roof because I was starting up a business to flip house mm -hmm. and sell. Mm -hmm. Bam, 2008, and I lose everything because the house, they don't value for what I buy them for. So I have to get rid of them in short sale. I could go sitting uh, uh, under, under the Grand Central uh, Station right. and tell them, say, society, fear right. me. Right. But no, if, if what don't kill you, make you stronger. Mm -hmm. and, and, and that's what I do. I pick up my pieces. I brush myself off and say, you know what? It's not when you fall, you don't utterly cast down. But you fall, and while you fall, you start to study how you're going to get up and how you're going to stand up when you get up. Mm -hmm. So the next time I rise and I find myself with money, I say, you know what? I'm going to do something at my homeland because that market not going to crash. <laughs> <laughs> you understand? And that's what I do, and go and build my house here. And I said, even if, if, I, if this market crash, I'm still standing. 
You understand? So when you fall down and and people failing you and people turning their back on you, they weren't the one that had been to come with you. It's not everybody had been to carry you to the top. You started not gonna end up as you finish. You're gonna is as as a journey in life is like a chain. You hop on and people step on. Mm. New people step on. Yeah. And you stop again. You people you watch people step on. New people step on. It's not everyone gonna go to your destination with you. Mm -hmm. People mm -hmm. gonna step on and they're gonna step off. But guess what? The chain keep moving, right? Yeah. Right. The chain, the chain keep moving. So when one door shut, there will be many open. Because you're on a journey and, and, and the journey is a train. And you watch when the train comes. Sometimes a lot of them come out. And only one come out. Mm. And another time it opened the door, the crowd that come on in, you know, they rush in to find seats to, to rush with each other. But that's the journey in life. People are going to have fun. It's not where you start with, you're going to finish. Mm -hmm. It's not who you start with, you're going to expect. It's not who you do things to, you expect to carry them. Those are the ones going to cut your throat and fail. Mm -hmm. But there going to be another station where the change going to stop. And new people going to come in and want to work with you. And that's the station you're going to watch. Who you're going to get up from your seat and give to sit down. Mm -hmm. You understand? But you watch while the chain going. How much is going to happen? Sometimes you come down, you're alone on that section of the chain, you know, because it was full and then afterward, mm -hmm. where did everybody go? Mm -hmm. You're alone sitting in that row. You ever to go to substation and you the subway and take the, the, the you understand? <laughs> Sometimes it's so crowded that they hang over you. Mm -hmm. Then the train make a stop. And when you look you're alone in, in, in that thing. But then you make another stop and you see this rushing. That's how you're gonna see. Mm -hmm. People got to come and people gonna go, but this one. All you need is that one. Mm -hmm. That true one. Apart from yourself. Apart from God, you put God first, but He's gonna send one, that one, and that one is gonna be the what, the driver who will sit in the train. You say, I understand? You only want somebody in the, in the in the driving seat to drive you along. That one, and is the pilot. Okay, so that one person, the train won't stop unless he press that brake. And that's the only person you want, that mm -hmm. driver. Because you're going to pick up people and you're going to let them out. But you still keep your going. Mm -hmm. Okay? That one. So, that's, how, that's how you're going to motivate yourself and do your business. Mm -hmm. But you have to hunger. You have to feel that void inside you. Something inside of you. Mm -hmm. Do I want to? Do I want to? But yes, I have to, I have to, I have to. You know, you have to feel that emptiness. If you don't feel something, nothing inside of you, mm -hmm. you don't want it. Mm -hmm. You know, you have to feel that hunger, that hunger, mm -hmm. that void, that weakness, that that something that you want to you know. Food cannot fill it up. Right. <laughs> you understand? No matter how you eat, you still feel that mm -hmm. that emptiness, that emptiness. And what that emptiness is telling me, I can't be where I am. I can't be where I started. This is not me. This is not what I'm open for. I'm open to be above. I'm not just to get by. Right. I want to have it. I want to have it. I'm not going to go dream, bend the, the, the man that owns Amazon. He know where he started, the, mm -hmm. the Facebook man. I'm not going to grudge him. Because he know where he started. Mm -hmm. They have to come from the dust, from the basement. Mm -hmm. But did he stay in the basement? Mm -hmm. No. He didn't. The same man that stand that job, that tell you that the one that owned iPhone. Mm -hmm. Where he started. Yeah. 
The same one that won 